What's up everybody, it's the Matt Militia coming back at you, and I know it's been a very long time, but here we go, it is a new deck profile, I almost forgot the word because it's been so long, new deck profile, I updated my wind up deck, the, the really, the, well, in my opinion it was good, but I updated it, made it different, added a couple new things just to give it some edge. So, um, first of all, we will start with the main monsters. There is three copies of Cyber Dragon. There's three copies of a wind-up soldier. Three copies of wind-up dog. Three copies of my favorite wind up honeybee. Two warriors. One wind up knight. One wind up magician. One wind up shark. Those that that's it for the wind up monsters. Now there's a couple extras in here that I just added because they help. Which is Top Runner, Black Luster Soldier, Sacred Soldier, Winged Karibo, and Cyber Angel Vrash. That's the main monsters. Now I know they're weird, but the deck works, trust me. In spell cards, there's three copies of Zen Mail Function. Two copies of the legendary wind up key. One copy of weights and Zen measures. One polymerization. One copy of Sprite's Blessing. One copy of my body as a shield. One copy of Double Spell. A Swords of Revealing Light, staple for any deck. And a reinforcement of the army. That does it on its spells. And finally, we get to the trap cards, which is two copies of Overwind, two copies of Zen Maelstrom, Zen Marek, Trap Hole, and Magic Jammer. That does it for the traps. And finally, we have the extra deck. There's two wind-up Zen Masters. Number F, Zero Utopic Future. Stardust Dragon. And Cyber Twin Dragon. And that will do it for this wind-up deck. Yep, there you go. Wind up deck profile 2017. Like, comment, subscribe, do stuff. Yay, get your game on. Yeah, reference.